Dude, we're here with another Bass and Basics. Probably one of the new hottest trends that is going on right now is braid to fluorocarbon. We're gonna show you how to tie that knot and keep it simple. All these other guys use all of these crazy knots that I can't even pronounce. Today, we're gonna show you how to tie the simplest knot for a beginning. Let's get it. So I don't even know if you guys can see how tiny that knot is. I'm gonna hold it in focus, put my hand behind it, show you if you can see it. But all of these knots out here, the FG knot, all of those knots are so cumbersome. This knot is one that I almost want to say that I taught myself how to tie this knot. I believe I saw this knot on Orlando Wilson or Bill Dance a long time ago as a kid. And I've been using this knot since, uh, but I will say this, this knot, I don't even hear it come through my guides. It's got to be the best knot for fluorocarbon to braid leader knots. So I'm going to show you how to tie it real quick. So here's what I do. Okay, you got your braid and you're always going to want to fold over your mono or your fluorocarbon leader first. So I'm going to leave the braid up here. Let's not worry about the braid right now. We're going to fold this over to where we got a double deal, if you can see that. So now that we got that, all right, this is simple. We're going to take the line and we're going to lay it just like that in between my fingers while pinching both sides. Now with lighter line, I do probably, I want to say 12 to 15 wraps. So I've got these two lines pinched. You see that? And there's still a loop there. All right. I start my wrapping. One, two, three, eight, 12, 13. And I'm going to stop at 13. And I'm going to take that tag in of that braid and go through that, that loop that we pinched, okay? Now, what I'm going to do is I'm going to add... See how it's starting to tighten down? Now I'm going to add lubrication. Now that it's lubricated, you want to pull all of those knots down at the same time. And, dude, I've got five pound line to a 10 pound braid lead, and I'm pulling. I'm pulling. Now you can see how perfectly form this knot but is just like you would the fg knot i do a couple of secure wraps right here uh like a loop knot a couple loop knots just to prevent slippage on the braid end of it and i cut that really close all right now look at this thing. Look at this thing. I, I watch pros all the time on TV and I hear that knot coming through there and I'm looking at how tiny this knot is and how strong it is. And I can attest to how strong it is. Take it and I'll get my scissors there and I'll just clip. And you see that? So when the line's coming through your guides of your eyelids on your fishing pole, this is going to be coming back this way. You will not have that that tag in coming through there making that noise i hardly hear it it doesn't bog up in the reel uh this is the knot that i use i believe it's called a bimini twist but i could be wrong we're just gonna call it the mike bass twist and that's what we're gonna we're gonna rename the knot the mike bass knot so try it let me know how this works for you this is the knot you want for braid to fluorocarbon. Trust me. Mike Bass signing out. If you like this kind of content, please like and subscribe to the channel. Show your boy some love. All right. See you next time.